Top story here at five. State Rep Mary Cavanaugh is going to avoid jail time in her second DUI case. Cavanaugh was pulled over back in February with two flat tires and pleaded guilty to the crime last month. Sean Lay now with us live, and you spoke with her as she left court. Sean. And I had a question for the state representative. After her second DUI conviction, is she going to step down from her seat at the state house? And this is her answer to me. We do have to ask if the state rep is going to resign her seat. I will not be resigning my seat. Um, I did want to make the statement that uh, I have accepted responsibility for my actions. Um, I am seeking the support and help that I need. No resignation from her state house seat. No jail time for Democratic State Representative Mary Kavanaugh after being sentenced today for her second drunk driving offense. Kavanaugh's attorney says February 25th, Kavanaugh was driving after being at a bar, driving on two blown tires and swerving, stopped by Livonia police. They say she fit the legal limit for being super drunk. They go, 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 go. All right, Mary. Legal limit in Michigan is a point oh eight, okay? You blew a point one six one seven six. Kavanaugh must undergo drug and alcohol testing and take part in a twenty four month sobriety court program. Then she'll be on probation. I am looking forward to using this to become a better person, and I am seeing that there is another life, and it's sober life. Also speaking in court, Christine Wofford to tell the judge she's been hit twice by drunk drivers. I really wanted to con commend them for stopping her. She could have really caused some damage. Wofford says Kavanaugh's offense was so serious, she could have killed someone. That you, this, you're, you're absolutely right about that. Uh, you know, we're just, we're, in dealing in the here and now, we're so grateful that we are at this point right now rather than other places. Now, Mary Cavanaugh is the Democratic Vice Caucus Chair. She serves on a couple of committees in Lansing, Tax Policy Committee, along with the Local Government and Finance Committee. We asked if she would be stripped of those committees or some of them. She didn't answer, but Todd Perkins, you just saw there, her attorney said those decisions will be made up in Lansing going forward. We're live tonight in Livonia. Sean Lay, Local 4. Yeah. All right, Sean.